Hey all my movie maniacs, it's the Final Cut, Mark the Movie Man here, welcome back. And I got another short film review for you today. This one's called Killer Friends. And here we get a story of four friends who go out camping, but one of them will not return. <laughs> yes, Killer Friends. Story about one annoying roommate who someone just can't stand and really is taking some drastic measures to end their relationship. Ah, a play, this was directed directed by Zach Noah Towers as well as Tina Carbone. They co-directed this and let me tell you this was a lot of fun. This is a lot of fun. It, it, it's playing off of that, you know, camp horror that one where, you know, the plotting to kill someone and only things just do not go according to plan. Namely because the character who uh uh, is the annoying one, Scott, played by Zach Noah Towers, who also wrote uh, this script as well as co-directed it. He is the most annoying <laughs> character ever. Oh my God, some of the things he says will make your jaw drop and you can kind of see the motivation for other people in there to not want to have him around anymore. And I, I just loved that character. He, he really uh, steals the scenes that he's in and his dialogue really triggers so many different things and I'm sure it's going to uh, get a reaction on the audience who watch this. Now everybody else as well in here too, uh, Gina, uh, Jenna Lee uh, Carrero, and I may have mispronounced that, I apologize, as the Jill character, David Racky in here as Brian and Peggy uh, Sinat, uh, also have a great chemistry together, love their dialogue and their banter, really well written script, and it's, in a, it's a short film too, so it doesn't overstay its welcome by any means. The skits and the uh, hits come at you very quick, and as with every short, there is a bit of a twist E ending to it. Uh, <laughs> really, this is a lot of fun, and I laughed quite a bit, and jaw dropped a few times as well, and I think yours will too. Check it out. I'll put a link down below for as much information as I can give you. I know it's hitting the festival scene now, and hopefully, maybe you'll see it on Hulu and Vimeo soon. Folks, indie short films are just deserve just as much attention as the indie full feature films. Here, people are cutting their teeth, learning, and also bringing some very entertaining material material and shorts especially fitting for the attention span of uh, many people out there so make sure you support your indie shorts as well as your indie features that is where we get a lot of our creative stuff please subscribe if you haven't already so close to that thousand subscribers got one month to hit it can only do it with your support i uh, thank every single one of you out there and until next time keep that ticket stub